Good morning, everyone. Mic test one, two, one, two. Just felt like doing an early stream today. Uh, partly, part of the reason is because I'm not going to be able to stream later today. I've got some things going on. And uh, so I was like, why not? I wake up early anyway. Why not get a little stream in this morning? So welcome everybody that's already here. Welcome. We're going to play some PUBG this morning. Hopefully we'll be able to find some servers that are not all bots. But we will see. We will see what happens here. Solo, third person, Tego. Let's see what happens, guys. What's up, the Batman? What's up, Triple Seven? Jacob, Quacking Ducko, Mukhtar, Aparna, Ranjit, Jacob, Tudala. I think I already said Jacob, I did. <laughs> Darshan, Big Daddy Evil, Jason, a loner. Welcome, guys. Welcome. I need some morning coffee. I need some morning coffee to start the day off right. Well, if we have too much trouble finding matches in uh, my regular servers, we might have to try the EU servers then. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I always go for the chicken dinners, Jacob. You know me. I get chicken dinners every day. Ah, oh, it's some good coffee. I switched my coffee brands. I'm trying out, uh, trying out some McDonald's coffee the next time I drink it. We'll see how that tastes. I hear that McDonald's has really, really good coffee. Lots of people have told me that. Thanks for that rude Radeva. Yes, if you guys are enjoying, hit that like button. Hey, what's up, Jason? I'm doing good, man. Hope you're doing good, too. What's up, Mark Zola? I don't always work out in the morning. I hardly ever work out in the morning, actually. All right. 
right, first match, let's go. Dinner time in Australia? Well, it is currently 6.48, 6.48 in the morning where I live. Six forty eight AM Dropping into Tago. What's up, Humongous? It's going good, man. Your name's Quacken? Got it, man. Try to remember it's Jake, my friend. I grow Uzi. Love the loot increase. Double micro Z. Oh yeah. My favorite gun. <laughs> Thing seems quiet. Too quiet. Too quiet. I think I need a cheek pad. Oh, there's the K2. This building had what I needed. Plenty of first aid kits. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, everyone, whatever time it may be where you are. Welcome to the stream, and hit that like button if you're enjoying. I have enough five five six now.
Yeah, over 300, 556 five, is probably enough. What's the new gun like? If I had to compare it to a gun that's already in the game, I would say it's like a scar. Hey, what's up, Francis? Welcome to the stream, man. I would say it most reminds me of the scar. Oh my gosh, this loot. I don't know if this loot increase is a good thing. Because now there's never gonna... There's rarely gonna be a time when you win or lose gunfights because you simply had better loot if everybody basically has the same loot, you know what I mean? Why do they do that sometimes? Why do they put their arms out like they're gonna ledge grab and then turn their bodies sideways? That's so weird. Eight times scope. It also kind of takes the fun away, uh, the loot increase also kind of takes the fun away from finding that good loot, because it used to be special, like, oh man, I found some good loot, but now it's, there's nothing special about it, because almost every house has good loot. Oh, except for these, apparently. Oh my god, I have so many meds. I don't think I need to pick up any more meds. What's up, Mike? What's up, Rhett? Yep, I like this guard too. First throwable I found. Hmm. I still haven't found a red dot or holographic for my K2 either. You get one of those stat. That's the same building I was just in. Like we got a new subscriber, a couple new subscribers. Welcome. Thanks for subscribing. I don't want the two times scope. It's going to be too hard to control. That two times scope is the worst. a stun grenade. Whoops, why did I do that? Suspended mag for the DMR. Three times scope. Oh, smoke grenade. Man, they really don't like uh, red dots or hollows on this map, I think. Oh, there's a real grenade, finally. Thought that was a door. There's the door.
Um. Yeah, probably should have been paying attention to that blue. Pretty far outside the zone. Didn't we just have? Didn't we just go past a car a couple minutes ago? Oh, we found some bugged out windows that you can't jump through. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, I think there's a car in this garage, if my memory serves. Yes. Let's go. driver pro driver right here That's a glitch. I think that other player is just glitched out. This guy doesn't have a holographic either. I kind of like the iron sights on this gun though. Nope, no holographic here. Or red dot. Holographic or red dot. There's two four time scopes in here. Oh, there's a red dot. That'll do. Flash hider. I mean, uh, compensator. here hey what's up Helion four times Level three best. Now we're talking. That's a great find. That is a great find. Level three best. a lot of ghosts. 
lots of ghost players. That's the second ghost player I've seen. The ghost players are the ones that are not really there. They just look like they're there. Yeah, there's airdrops. We just haven't haven't seen any planes come by yet. I just watched Back to the Future and I really feel like this Hyundai from the back kind of feels like the DeLorean. Oh, today I'm watching Back to the Future too with my grandma. I like this new map. It's good. It's real good. Whoa, 60 likes. Thanks for everybody who's hit the like button so far. I appreciate that, guys. Here comes the air airdrop plane. Here's the airdrop at North 10. That's going to be across the water. It's going to be in the water. Alright. Well, that sucks. Bro, man, I don't. I don't think I can get the care package. At least we killed the guy that was trying to get it. Now, if I can figure out who's shooting at me and from where, maybe I can get it. I really want to try for it. There is a boat right by it. Let's see what it's got. Mark 14, yes, thank you. Oh, I didn't get any ammo for it. Whoopsie, we'll have to go find some 762 now. Let's see if we can find some 762 real quick. Should be okay, I think. Why do I have so many grenades? I'll keep them. If 
phase three, I gotta get over that bridge. This is this blue zone's gonna hurt. Oh no, oh no. Good. Saved it. I can't believe we got that uh, care package. Oh my god, there's people fighting on the bridge. Sorry, weed man. I just want to heal. I don't want to fight you, bro. I just want to heal. Somebody needs to shoot that guy in the face. I heard footsteps up there. I think there's another guy up there. That was a that was a close one, guys. But we did it. Uh oh, smoking buggy. Five, six. Does this bot have five five six? No. I think there are some downstairs. No. Yep. Dang. I need to drop like two first aid kits to make room for some more ammo here. I think that should be alright. Got a Mark 14. That's always nice. I just pulled up right there. <laughs> Guy potatoed all his shots. He was pretty close, wherever he was shooting from. Very close. There's the other guy, he's downstairs. My vest took a little damage, but not much.
Guns closing in. Pop this energy drink. Oh, there's seven alive. We're in the top ten already. Nice. taken off on his motorcycle over there. This guy probably doesn't see me, I'm hoping. See if he gets into a gunfight. Not going to be much cover out here. Motorcycle guy's back at it. There's a guy. Appears to be in the safe zone there. There's my other buddy. His name's You Got Smurf, but I think we just smurfed him. Good game. First match, chicken dinner. Those guys were some pretty serious contenders, too. Wow. Good game. Another chicken dinner on Tego. Hit that like button if you guys enjoyed that slaughter right there. Whoa. Thanks, Humongous. Appreciate that, man. Thanks for all the GGs, everybody. Stephen J, what's up? Stephen J in the chat. Oh, did I? Oh, yeah, that's right. I think I, think I remember mentioning something about his name before. All these guys with these, uh, with these funny names about how good they are getting killed by a guy who's named Average Sniper. <laughs> What's up with that? GG, though. That was a great way to start the day with a chicken dinner. Great way to start the day, guys. Well, fortunately, you can rewind while we search for another match, Rally. Just make sure when you're done watching, you hit that little button that says live. So you're up to date with the stream.
Thanks, holy crap, Eric. Uh, no, Sean, kid, I'm going to play for a few hours, but I do have to work today. I have work and social stuff to do today. It was either it was either stream today in the morning or not stream at all. So I chose to stream today in the morning. How did I see the last guy? Well, I'm glad you asked. Let me explain it. Somebody in the chat, uh, let's see, Jacob Cruz wants to know how I saw the last guy. So if we rewind uh, to right here, let's go a little further. You can see, you can see here, there's a guy. See that guy right there? We now know his position is around 250. Now fast forward just a little bit when we fight this other guy. Now that we killed that guy, we know that the last guy is somewhere over here. And if you look close, you can actually see him right there. So when you're in the final circle and you kill the second to last guy, you don't want to stay in the same place because the last guy is going to know that's where you are. So that's why I immediately ran out and I turned to face this direction over here because I knew that guy, if he's a good player, is going to try and take advantage of me assuming my health is a little weak from that last gunfight, and he was right. But I was able to get him first because I was expecting him. I was expecting him to pop up right around this area. I hope that answers your question, my friend. I hope that answers your question. What do I do for work? I'm an IT consultant. I help very small businesses that don't need or can't afford in-house IT support. I help them with servers, networking, computer and software installation, and troubleshooting. What's up, Greg? That was a very close shave, Helion. Those are the best kind of chicken dinners where you think where you're in the middle of the gunfight and you can out of the out of your peripheral vision, you can see your health bar going down, you know you're taking damage, but you just try your best to stay on target and all of a sudden you get the win. That was a great fight with that last guy, yeah. And I was already a little bit low on the health there too. Right, here we go with our second match on Tega. Hit that like button if you guys are enjoying the stream. We got 118 likes and it looks like we got a $5 super chat that I somehow did not see. Thank you very much Richard Lopez for the $5 that you sent 13 minutes ago. Always great to have you Richard and thank you very much for your generosity my friend. That's awesome. Now what when I land in the cities, I notice I have trouble finding things like red dots and holographics, so I'm going to try and land not in the city this time. PUBG on is crossplay between console and Stadia, but not for PC. Like, Xbox... PlayStation and Stadia can all play together, but PC does not cross-play with any other platform. And I am playing on PC, 
hence the keyboard and mouse that you can see. Some ammo, but no gun. That's weird. Here we go. If I hadn't jumped there, I think I would have died. You know why that guy didn't shoot? It, it seemed like that guy didn't shoot at me, but the real reason he didn't shoot is because he pulled the trigger too early. That's ha That happens a lot when you pull the trigger too early. You're in the middle of loading the gun, you pull the trigger. Because I actually think he started to reload before I did, but he panicked and pulled the trigger before the gun was loaded, and it didn't finish, or it, it couldn't shoot. It couldn't shoot. Very unfortunate for him, but very good for me. I'll try a 3x on the K2. That's enough ammo. Not the DMR I want, but it'll do for now. So level two backpack. How'd I miss that? Just not paying attention, I guess, to the loot that I need. I will take an M24 for now. Still need a level two helmet. To answer someone's question in the chat, the name of the guy I killed for the chicken dinner on the last match was Bad Boy Loser. You can feel free to rewind the stream. Uh, if you want to double check the spelling of the name or anything, my friend, the stream is rewindable. Hey, there's a car. Oh, F's in the chat. M24 shots. That guy had a level 2 helmet. I'm glad I didn't shoot him in the head on the first one. Because now I can get his level 2 helmet. I ran 
I ran right over him. SKS. Nothing that I need, really. Hey guys, will you give me one second? I'll be right back. I gotta throw some clothes uh, from the washer into the dryer real quick. So give me one second. I'll be right back. found money in uh, the laundry. Is there a bot shooting at me right now? Sorry for the AFK guys, I had to switch my clothes from the washer to the dryer. Uh, where am I? Alright, I need to grab that car. Oh, there's, there's the guy. Total bot totally saw me. Oh, we're getting our shots are on today with the M twenty four, huh? Dub TV, what's up, man? Thanks for renewing your membership, bro. Good to see you. He did the seat swap and got there before me. Good game, buddy. Good game. Yikes. 
Yikes. You got the seat swap on me before I could. Very nice. Very nice. Thanks for the two bucks, Dub TV. Appreciate that, man. I hope you have a good day at work, man, and thank you for your generosity, as always. I'm feeling amazing, Garrett. How come you always ask me that? Is that you that always asks if I'm feeling okay? That's a weird question, man. <laughs> I'm doing great, and I hope you are too. It's just kind of weird. It, I, if, if I to Garrett, I totally apologize if you're not the guy that always asks if I'm okay. Um, but if you are, I just want to let you know that's kind of strange <laughs> that you always come into the chat and say, "Are you okay?" I don't know if that's like a language thing or or what, but yes, my friends, I am very okay, and I hope you are too. <laughs> I did just wake up, so I'm still kind of like I just got I just got my morning coffee in me. What's up, Paul S? What's up, Philip D? Here we go, guys. Let's see what happens. <laughs> nice, Alan. Nice. That's one of the downfalls of being a streamer is people, um, sometimes people expect you to always act the exact same way. Uh, like if you don't act the same way you acted yesterday or the day before, people wonder if you're okay. And that's fine, but you know, it kinda, kinda makes me feel like sometimes people don't think I'm a human. You know what I mean? Like, oh, I'm always gonna be happy and bubbly. Dude, I just rolled out of bed and had my coffee and I'm streaming. Just like everybody else, it takes me a little while to get into the group. I I don't wake up like, hey guys, average sniper here. Da, da, da. It takes me a little while. I gotta have my coffee. I gotta eat. You know, I gotta I gotta start feeling good. I'm not a robot. I'm just a normal person, just like all you guys. But I appreciate the concern. I always do. Yes! I am not a robot. I am just a normal dude. Yeah, this is looking good. Oh, you didn't you didn't do anything wrong, Garrett. I'm just I'm just I'm just using what you said to let people know that like you know I'm just a dude. Okay, you can keep the bots running at me. No, Garrett, I'm not mad at you, man. You didn't do anything wrong. That's just, you know, when I just don't want people to always think I'm going to act and be a certain way. 
just be just because I'm not acting the exact same way I did yesterday doesn't mean anything's wrong. Everybody has different moods, you know. It's not black and white. I'm not like all. I'm not gonna be like always in a super upbeat, happy mood, and I'm not always gonna be in a super sad mood or anything like that. Sometimes I'm just gonna be normal, you know. And when and when people consistently ask me if I'm okay because I'm not acting the same way I did yesterday or the last stream, it, it does get on my nerves a little bit because I'm like, dude, I am just a normal person, you know? I'm not always in a super happy mood, but it doesn't mean I'm in a bad mood or that anything's wrong either. It just means I'm a human. I'm just a human. <laughs> Let me live. All right. Man sent from the future to slay only bots. Yes. What was that? That was like four bots that attacked me at once. I need to find a car. I need to find a car. Sundays are everywhere, man. And it really sounds like there's a bot battle going down over there. Bot battle. Cool, Garrett. Cool. Nothing but love, man. How's the new map? I really like it. It's like... I think it's really good. I think it's really good. You guys want to see the bridge jump? There's a there's a bridge that you can jump over in the car. I'll show it to you guys. Garrett Hoskins, thanks for the five bucks. Get that chicken. We good. Oh, we're always good, Garrett. Thank you very much, man. We've got uh, one chicken dinner so far. We will definitely try for another one. Thank you for the $5, Garrett. That was the bridge jump. Nothing special, but it's kind of a cool little feature, you know? Kind of a cool little feature, that's all. Now we need to find um, an airdrop and get a care package. No, the bots don't insta-kill anymore. Definitely not. Helion is 100% correct that they nerfed that one pretty quick. Thank God, too. Those bots were, like, unbelievably OP. Those bots were unbelievably OP. Don't think I need more than one pin. Unless I want to try to throw the pin at the last guy. Helion. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was just too epic. That was just too uh, such an epic way to end the stream there. Killed by a frying pan. One millisecond before you would have died in the blue zone. Sometimes. It be like that. Oh, look at this place. Look at these buildings. Is this like um, a Japanese style building? 
It reminds me of uh, ninja movies I used to watch that took place in Japan. already have level to everything. This map is so weird because it feels like a small map, but it's just as big as Erangel. Very deceiving. here playing it dropped the care package. If it did, it dropped it on the other side of the map. Got nothing. Got nothing. I love the sound of this car, that's for sure. Uh, Beverly Hills Ninja was the one with Chris Farley. Beverly Hills Ninja. Thought I forgot to start the gyre, but I didn't. News on. I gotta get it across the bridge. Put a little mark down on the bridge. I've seen Wrath of Man. That's the one with Jason Statham, right? Yeah, I saw that. I liked it. There's another guy right there driving away.
I still want to find an airdrop even though we're getting pretty far into the match. You know? That guy has an airdrop. He's got level 3 here. I hear an airdrop playing. There's the airdrop at 200. Every time I go for an airdrop, that's what happens. I just lose my ability to drive because I drive straight towards it and I just go over whatever obstacles are in my way. I don't have any smoke grenades. I had to have just landed. Yep, there it is. Oh, this guy's right here. God damn. Whoa! Maybe the best kill I've ever gotten in PUBG right there. That was, that was sickening. That was sickening. That's all I can say. This care package whore over here had already looted a care package, and he's out here trying to take another one. What the f, bro? Uh. Not hit my vest. Good. Should be able to get a nice shot at him from the roof here. Let's do another one. Let's do another jump. Oh my god, we're on point today with our jumps. I don't think they're expecting that. They are not expecting that to happen. Yuku Norigato, that was fire. My dude, you are more than average. Freaking assassin. Thank you so much for the generous donation, my friend. That's awesome. Thank you so much, bud. Any 14 and a Groza this guy had. I don't want either of those. This guy didn't have care package loot. But he's got really nothing that I need. We'll take uh, half his painkillers, a med kit, I guess. And yeah, same loadout as me, basically. I wish I could find another Mark 14. Thanks again for the five dollars, Kiyuku Norigato. That looks like an interesting place to go in yellow.
Why don't I take the Groza? Because I'm using the new K2. I want to get used to the new gun. Not a big fan of the Groza anyway. Get some weird kills today. I like it. Weird kills today, guys. I hear a guy in the building over there. Whoa, those sounds were so off, guys. The sound was so off on that. It didn't sound like it was behind me. It sounded like it was in front of me. And we almost killed that guy, too. Wow. Too bad we got... It would have been nice to have a chicken dinner on that game because we got such fantastic kills. But, hey, let's move on to the next one. No sense crying over spilled milk, right? And we almost turned on that guy, too. Jeez. That was kind of nuts. <laughs> Oh my god. I can't believe, uh... We gotta watch a replay. We have to watch a replay on that, uh... That jump out of the car move. Oh my gosh, because that was just too epic. Here it comes, guys. Here comes the replay. Oh my god. <laughs> I've seen adrenaline syringe on the ground I didn't pick up. You guys want to see that? I want to see that in slow mo. I want to see it in slow mo. It's a Hyundai, not a DeLorean. But it does kind of look like a DeLorean, I'll give you that. Man. That was so nuts. That was so nuts. I'm still in disbelief about how how good that went jumping out of the car when it was flipping through the air like that. That was crazy. $2, thanks for the two bucks, man. Appreciate that, bro. 
Guys, I gotta run to the bathroom real quick. Uh, empty out the bladder while we search for the next match. I'll be right back. Go. Perfect timing to start the match. All right, give me the K2. I'm really liking that gun. Give me the K2. Oh, well, that's what it is. It's bots that land late. But the bots still land pretty late, giving us a bunch of uh, easy kills, easy XP. I 
I got an idea, PUBG. Why don't you just send all the bots to me? Because you, you just sent five of them in a row. So why not why not just send them all? And give me like 50 kills. Just get it over with and send all the bots to me, PUBG. Come on. Send me all your bots. Might have been a real player, actually. Not sure. Not sure if that one was a real player or a bot. Send me all your bats. Bot can't make up his mind which side of the damn tree he wants to be on. Couldn't make up his mind. Get an eight times scope, man. Need an eight times scope on this, on this map. Where's that crate? He died right around here, right? Maybe he was further away. I don't know. I always do that. I kill somebody and then completely forget where they were when I killed them. There it is. Thought it was a little further away, yeah. I wonder how many bat kills we can get it if we just go for all the shots we hear. Oh, I need a car. We're eight kills in. I think all of them are bots, except maybe one of them was questionable. I don't know. Whoa, almost 200 likes, guys. We need 10 more likes to hit 200. Thanks to everyone who has contributed to the 190 likes so far. If you haven't hit that like button yet, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Helps a lot.
Still need some loot. I haven't even bothered to loot most of the bots that I've killed. They usually don't have anything that good. This just feels, it just feels like I'm playing Arangale. I love it. Whoa, thanks for breaking 200 likes, everybody. We're at 210 likes now. That is freaking awesome. For a morning stream, oh man. Alpha Reaper 15, still one of the most humble YouTube, or streamers on YouTube. Keep up the workouts and diet, stay healthy. Alpha Reaper, thank you very much for the kind words and for the generous $5.56. I appreciate that a lot, my friend. I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. Alpha Reaper with the 556. Five, Look at this guy's a waterfall. Ah! Oh man, that's so dumb. They should have made it so you could jump down the waterfall. What fun is that if you can't jump down the waterfall? PUBG logic right there. PUBG logic at its finest. Now having said that, that's a dope looking waterfall. Should have also made it so you can hide in it. This would make a really nice thumbnail, right? those boosts. Nice. Boosts galore.
Rippity rip. I saw a dinosaur. I did. I did see a dinosaur. see a dinosaur. What's up, Andro? Stefan. Couple energy drinks. Lots of bots, man. Lots of bots. Probably because we're playing so early in the morning where I live. Off peak hours. Kind of fun looking at the kill count though and seeing 16 kills.
17 kills, what? It's bot-tastic out here, guys. It's bot-tastic. Seven alive. I better be more careful. We gotta run into a real player sooner or later, right? Shoot that guy's foot, so that's all I could see. Hmm, three enemies left. Alive, three enemies left. Those two houses are in. That's not good. Don't hear any shots going off. Phase five's pushing now. Here, car.
There he goes. Shit, he sees me. So the last two guys. His name is Dixie Normus. One left. It's the guy that was driving, I think. There he is. Thanks for the easy chicken dinner. 20 kills. Oh my god. GG. What? That's kind of crazy. <laughs> Ooh. Whoa. GG guys. GG, hit the like button if you enjoyed the 20 kill, 20 kill chicken dinner. Alan, thanks for the two bucks, man. Hi, YouTube. Hi, Mom. <laughs> thanks, Alan. Great to have you, bro. That was pretty nuts, guys. Steven, Steven, thanks for subscribing. Josh Hatfield with the $10, way better. Let's go, average. Thank you very much for the $10, Josh Hatfield. I appreciate that, my friend. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Nice, relaxing morning. Just killing a whole bunch of bots, that's all. No big deal. <laughs> they sent like eight bots at me in the beginning of the match, which is where I got most of my kills. Like back to 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 back. Garrett, have a good night, man. Yep, we already know it's mostly bots, Nick. We've said that many times. That's why I'm not, like, super excited about it, you know? But thanks. Thanks for rubbing it in even more. Appreciate that. Funny kills against all real players would be epic.
Thanks, Steven. How's the weather in Florida? We just had a tropical storm. Other than that, it's fine. By hitting the fence. Come on, PUBG. That's funny, I'm literally shooting the fence and I'm like, why am I hitting the fence? You gotta be able to laugh at yourself sometimes. Giving me more bots to kill. I love it. Thanks for all the bots. Thanks for all the bots. you guys the good loot is at these little it's not in the cities it's at these little places on this map maybe all the maps are like that now i don't know eight times scope already These little places are just full of good loot. Steps, where are they? I heard them. Care package, 210. Do I have a car? Yep. 210 on that care package. Let's get it. What's up, John Smith? Welcome, everybody, if you're just getting here. And thanks for all the likes, guys. We got 265 likes already. Everybody that's hit that like button so far, thank you very much. Thank you for supporting the stream. If you haven't hit the like button yet and you are enjoying the stream, 
Go ahead and hit that like button. It only takes a second. Stick with the K2 for now, because it's a new gun, and I'm not that big of a fan of the Grows anyway. Zodiac Valley, that's the guy we killed for the chicken dinner. Oh, we killed him again. Rip Kodiak Valley. We just killed that guy in the last match for the dinner. Sorry, bro. Oh my god, 14 energy drinks. I don't need any of that. I need that. One of these guys had... Nope, we're good. Oh, I do want more frags. I'll take as many frags as I can. And that guy might be pissed. Sorry, Kodiak Bailey. What's up, Fatal Hit List? Oh my god, we got another care package at 105. I forget where I put my car, so we're just gonna run to this one. I think I put my car somewhere behind that hill where the other care package is, but... I'm just gonna go on foot. It's a broken down car. Yeah, we're pretty close to this care bag, it's not too far away. Drops two care packages in pretty much the same place. That's weird, instead of giving somebody on the other side of the map a chance to get one. Some Mark 14. Yep, I want that.
Mark 14. Said guys. Alright, sorry, I just had to answer a work email. Oh, I need to find some 762. That's what I need, guys. 762. some what can I drop I can take a painkiller that'll probably free up some space I can take a painkiller and an energy drink I don't want to drop my nades so those throwables come in handy at the end of the match oh cheek pad I forgot I need that I'm in the zone here, that's good. Not pretty good. What's up, Hubcap? I 
I know what you mean, Fatal Hit List. Sometimes there's not. The game market right now seems a little stale. I agree with you. That's why I'm still playing PUBG. I mean, Warzone, Fortnite, Apex Legends. I just can't really get into those games for that long. Probably be a lot better if there was a more even playing field and there weren't so many cheaters exploits and people using like proneness devices for super aim assist and no recoil. I could probably get into some other more mainstream games if the developers would be more diligent about fixing that kind of stuff. Finally an extended mag. Really needed that. Oh my god, he's on the roof. I couldn't figure out where he was. I was like looking in all the windows. I'm like, where is this guy? He's just sitting on the roof. He, I don't even think he was that good of a player either. He, that's that's how PUBG goes, guys. You can get killed sometimes by somebody that's not as good as you. I'm not saying that guy wasn't as good as me, but it just seemed like that. You can get killed by somebody that's not as good as you just because you can't figure out where they are. <laughs> that is funny. All right, new match time, guys. New match time. We should have spectated that guy. All right. Hey, no problem, Bradley. Hope you're enjoying the stream. What's up, Inversions Shanaim? Welcome. What's up, Harin? spammers, self-promoters, and people who don't know what they're talking about in the chat. Sometimes people come in here and they type in how to download PUBG. Just no. Damn right, Lex. Damn right. Do I know Warhammer 40k? No. I do not. Sorry, my friend. Whoa. We're almost at 300 likes. I'm gonna have to go, uh... I'm gonna go have to, to like my own stream here. Now, let's see if we can work a little magic. I was the 297th like. You wanna help us get to 300 likes? Hit that like button. Uh, why I thought the other player wasn't that good? Well, I saw that he didn't have any skins, and he was on the roof, and I was out in the open, and he should have been able to kill me, like, super fast. But it took him, like, almost his whole magazine to kill me, even though he was right in front of me. 
Also, the way he peeked on the roof, he was exposing his whole body instead of just his head and shoulders, which also made me think, you know, he was kind of a newbie player. Nothing wrong with that, but when you play the game as much as I have for thousands of hours, you can make quick, quick judgment calls about other players just based on little things that you notice in the way that they play. Damn right, Alan. <laughs> Alright, here we go, guys. Let's have a good game. Let's have a good game. It is a pretty big map. <laughs> no problem, cookies. There is a real player that landed with me. Not a bot. Maybe it was a bot. I think a real player did land with me though somewhere. Yeah, he landed at this building over here now I remember. Maybe he didn't. Maybe he didn't. Maybe it was a bot. Maybe sometimes the bots come down on their parachutes the same time as normal players. Getting looted. Let's get looted. Look at all the holographics this time. I find that Mark 12. Haven't been able to use that as much as I'd like. Dang, we got tons of first aid kits. Seven already.
There's a car we can take, a little sports car. Maybe go get a care package or something. Hey, there's a boat right there, too. Oh, we definitely need this car. I'm gonna mark a bridge in yellow. Bridge block? Bridge block, anyone? drama in the chat, that's okay. We're all only human. I need to find a compensator, a DMR, some better attachments, some more boost. Let's go, let's go loot here. I thought that was a real player, the way he was like hiding and waiting for me, but I think it was a bot. Hey, there's our Mark 12. Go see if we can find anything else here that we need. Specifically boosts and attachments. There's a boost. Should be boosts everywhere around here. Four time scope, already got that. Oh, six time scope. Now we're talking. Oh, another boost. Very nice, very nice. if we could find some uh, grip and some muzzles. In fact, I, oh, there's a grip. I may have passed some other grips up, not realizing I still needed one. We've accomplished our mission on finding some boosts. I need a flash hider or a compensator. Better grip. Let me get back to my car.
Insane shots is down. Not in my house. Not in my house. Please don't spam the chat, Mr. Joel. Oh, my vest is better. And he's got no muzzle attachments. Bots do the, the weirdest thing. Like, look at this kid. What are you doing? Where are you going, man? He's like, I'm going to the zone, bro. I know I killed a guy right here. There's the crate. Just a little glitch there. Uh, nope, nothing I need. Ah, can't go over this bridge that way, I guess. Good to know. That's the jump bridge right there. doesn't have a muzzle either. I set up a trap. Oh man. His trap was obvious and his shots were amazing. Let's watch the death cam. Hey, skillful DTS. I'm doing good, man. How are you? Shouldn't have complimented that down as amazing shots. What that was is an amazing aim bot. So we're going to report this guy. Because that was uh, very obvious. Report. Watch the death cam again. And I'll explain to you guys play by play. What he's doing here. So basically all you have to do, you have to understand that aimbots don't hit 100% of their shots, you know, and they can be toggled on and off. So, because I'm moving here as aimbot missed, 
when he switched to the full auto gun, you can see it just locked on and pulled along and shot me right in the head. So that guy is, uh, that's what I call an obvious cheater when, uh, when they don't uh, even try to hide it, you know. If anybody thinks that guy wasn't cheating, you probably just don't have as much experience with the game to understand what it looks like when somebody uses an aimbot. That sucks, but whatever. We'll move on to another game. We'll play super aggressive. And if I get killed, we will spectate the last guy and cheer him on. Uh, no idea, Dana Mania. No idea. But whenever cheaters kill a streamer, if they know who the streamer is, they usually turn their cheats off because they're like, oh shit, I'm gonna get reported. <laughs> yes, sir, King Cracker. Uh, lots of bots, but I'm still finding games just fine. Now, there's always those instances where you can't tell if somebody's cheating or not because they just get really lucky shots. There have been tons of times that I've pulled off some crazy, wacky, good shots and have not, um, and have thought to myself, man, if I was the one that got killed by something like that, I would definitely hit the report button. So, fortunately, hitting the report button doesn't do anything, but if enough people hit the report button in a short amount of time, it issues a temporary ban to the account. Um, while, uh, and waits for somebody at PUBG to review the footage to see if they really were cheating or not. So if you think somebody's cheating, if it seems like it, just go ahead and hit that report button. Because if they're not cheating, they will not get reported enough times to get banned. Uh, but actually, I've been banned twice. Uh, just, I think it's just because trolls report me because they know I'm a YouTuber. So the ban system is kind of flawed. But it still works. It still works. It's not that bad. I uh, know they did not add duos to the map. Nope. Dead man. I don't tell people which server I'm on took because I like to discourage stream sniping. Thanks. Thanks, skillful DTS. Cheaters should have their balls crushed by a cactus. That's a little extreme. I know we all get mad at cheaters, and I feel the same way sometimes, but they are just people. to my holographic. I thought I picked one up. Oh, I didn't pick it up. That's what happened to it. That K2.
Hold on a second, guys. I missed a call from my grandma. Just want to make sure she's okay. Let me check my voicemail. Outside. I think I'm. I'm gonna run the micro Uzi this match just for fun. Anybody got a problem with that? Anybody got a mother effing problem with that? Micro Uzi is gonna be our main. Okay. Where are we? We're pretty central. Let's go find some. Let's go get into some fights. Let's, let's go get into some fights. Let's see what happens. Sorry guys, uh, some work stuff's coming in. 
I have been having to reply to it on my phone, so we'll have to make this our last match. Well, that's what happens. Sometimes you get your head blown off. I thought that guy was a bot. But, uh, let's, let's spectate him. And, uh, let's see if he can win the game. Alright, so this guy's got a car 98 and a barrel. Ouch, why does he have a barrel? That's the only... I don't think he's cheating. I mean, he obviously just got a good headshot on me, but... Let's spectate him, not because we're looking for cheats, but just because this is the last match, and I want to see if this guy can pull off the win. He's a level 500. And let's see how good of a player he is. Let's, uh... Let me look up his stats here. We'll see how, how good of a player this guy is. Let's see how many wins he's got recently. Let's see. Okay, so this guy has... A 3.8 kill death ratio. He's only played 10 games of solo. Headshot percentage is 28.9%. And uh, he doesn't have any recent wins. So, looks like a totally legit player to me here. I think. Let's see, let's see how good he does on here. Let's see how good he does. That was funny how that came out of nowhere. Because I was just like, this is probably our last match. And then I see a guy, I take my time, I think he's just a bot, and I end up getting shot right in the right in the head. That was funny. The only thing that makes me the only thing that makes me question whether this guy's legit or not is his loadout. And the reason for that is because the barrel loadout is preferred by cheaters. Uh, because they don't have to worry about controlling the recoil and the barrel deals out a high amount of damage I think higher even than the AK So it's the perfect gun if you're using an aimbot because it takes people out with just a couple bullets But if you're not using an aimbot, I don't see a lot of people that actually prefer the barrel You know, so let's spectate this guy and uh, let's see how good he does He's looking at this jump like what should I do here? Oh my god, he's almost fallen off the thing. Oh, he wouldn't have made that if there wasn't a little uh, little thing there to connect the bridge. Hey, what's up, Yellow Ducky? Tego is great. We got two chicken dinners on it, and one of them was a 20 kill chicken dinner, but that one was mostly against all bots. The first chicken dinner we got on here was uh, super sweaty. He's not even paying attention to that other bike. That was weird. He was like looking away from it. Didn't take the shot. Needs to do a boost. I'm gonna make some coffee real quick. I'll be right back. All right, coffee is brewing.
Has this guy killed anybody? I don't think so, right? Just me so far, I think. Hey, what's up, Uno? The coffee is ready. Thanks for all the likes, guys. We got 360 likes so far. That is awesome. This guy's just riding around having a good old time. I like it. going for headshots, but he's missing. Oh, he doesn't appear to be cheating, but he did, he got a real nice headshot on me, but I wasn't moving. I was also going for a headshot on him. I hope he gets a win. Looking at his stats from recent games, looks like this guy hasn't had a chicken dinner in a long time, but he seems like a he seems like an experienced player. He got that guy and he's dead. Well, that's why he doesn't have any chicken dinners recently. <laughs> Just because you're a good player doesn't mean you're immune to getting third party killed by Gen Reaper level 17. Gen Reaper. So, my first time trying the McDonald's coffee. I think I like it. It's pretty good. It's McDonald's French Roast.
Hey, what's up, Pam? What's up, Haley? No, I don't think this guy's hacking. Nobody said he's hacking. We're just spectating him because this is the last match I can play before I end the stream this morning. And uh, it's kind of nice to spectate and just watch other people's, uh, watch how other people play every now and then. Whoa, we're almost to 400 likes. We're at 372 likes. Thank you to everyone who's hit the like button so far. I appreciate you guys continuing to come to the stream and smack that like button. Now this guy's level 17 using an SKS and an M249. A very strange loadout. Very strange loadout. Let's see what his plan is here. How do I get my first 1,000 subscribers? Just uploading uh, Call of Duty videos back in like 2012. Thanks, Em. Oh, thanks for all the likes coming in, guys. I appreciate that. You think it's easier to play on PC than console? That's a good question. Um, it's easier on PC because you have a keyboard and mouse. Once you get used to that, you can aim more accurately. But it's also harder on PC because you're not dealing with people that are going to potato you. Pretty much everybody you come up against that's a real player is going to be very accurate with their keyboard and mouse as well. So I think playing on PC is much harder than console. Getting chicken dinners on console, uh, for me, was much easier than getting them on PC. Um, console, if you were to say PUBG console is harder, the only reason it's harder is because it's not made for controller and it's hard to aim. Um, so it takes a lots and lots of practice. Like, for example, Call of Duty and Battlefield are two great games that, uh, work awesome on console. They have aim assist. Uh, the aiming is really smooth with a controller, but PUBG was designed to be played with a keyboard and mouse. So when they ported it over from PC to console, uh, the aim system when using a controller was clunky and very crappy at best. Even people that have been using controllers their whole lives found themselves potatoing enemies all the time uh, because of how difficult it was to just use that controller to aim. So PUBG on PC is definitely harder. The only thing about console that makes it seem harder is how difficult it is to use a controller because the game simply is not designed to be played with a controller. But I think it happens on the 15th, Five Dogs Ranch, and thank you. I don't think I'd have the M249. Um, the SKS isn't weird. It's just weird that he has an M249 as his main gun. That gun has so much recoil. An M4 with no attachments would probably be better than having an M249, unless he plans to go prone every time he shoots somebody. Thanks, Nathan. my favorite too, Will, right? Oh, that sucks, D-Money. Two reports of banned scumbags. Yep. Well, anytime there's a new season and new updates, you're going to see an increase in players and therefore an increase in cheaters. No problem, Minecraft Lloyd.
No problem, Cookies. Yep, we're spectating this guy. He seems like a pretty good player. He moves correctly. I'm just wondering why he doesn't have... Um, why he's using the M249. My best guess, see how he's a level 17? I think, and, but he obviously knows how to play the game and knows how to move. This might be an old school PUBG player. He's playing the circle very well. He's going for the win. He might be an old school PUBG player that came back for the recent update and doesn't know how bad the M249 has been nerfed. If he hasn't played the game in a while, that would make sense. Because I certainly would never want to find myself in the final circle uh, with an M249. Because it just jumps everywhere, you know. I'd rather have the M249 for, like, a bridge block, you know. That was a great shot. So this guy this guy obviously knows what he's doing. No question there. This guy knows what he's doing. Only two enemies left. I kind of want to see this guy win. It's been a while since he's had a chicken dinner based on his stats. Oh, wait. No, that was the other guy's stats. Let me check. I don't know what these guy's stats are. Yeah, the... Uh... Oh, this is the last guy. Oh, he made it to the tree. Well, they're both going to have to move, so this could be anybody's game right here. This could be anybody's game. He's got the guy behind the tree sweating, that's for sure. He just did an energy drink. I... Oh man, he is smacking him. He's got him trapped there. I think that guy behind I think the guy he's got trapped behind the tree is gonna have to move first. He's throwing a smoke. Oh he tried to shoot him in the hand. This guy's playing it just like I would. The guy we're spectating. Yeah, go for the zone. Force him to come to you. Yeah, this guy's playing it just like I would. Definitely an experienced player. Oh man. <laughs> He fell for his trap. He fell for Stoven Block's trap. Oh my god. Hey, we can watch the death cam now too. Now we can watch the death cam on the guy that killed us. He peeked out just like that guy wanted him to and paid the price. He paid the ultimate price. All right, let's see how this guy killed me. I have a feeling he just got lucky and just aimed in and was already right on my head, I bet. Oh, he sees me. I see him. We both set up to shoot. Yep, he aimed in. He was right on my head and he got the shot. 
and then he died on the next one. That was a great stream, guys. That was a great stream. We have to watch a replay of the epic thing that happened, though. I don't know if anybody was here to see it, but let me hide my webcam real quick, and we're going to watch a quick replay of the most epic kill that I've got in uh, PUBG in quite a long time. It happened a little earlier today. So before we end the stream, let's check that out. Uh, let's see. I think it was right here. Let's see. Where did it happen? Which match was it? No, the bots don't insta-kill anymore. Definitely not. Well, it wasn't this one because... Oh, maybe it was. There's my level 3 gear. Oh, yeah, it was this one. Alright. If you guys weren't here for this, you're getting to see the replay right oh, now. this guy's right here. God damn it. Whoa! Maybe the best kill I've ever gotten in PUBG right there. And that was our epic uh, kill of the game right there. Oh my god, that was insane. That was insane. I don't know the last time I got a kill that good in PUBG. Uh, we also we also had a 20 kill chicken dinner, but nothing too epic about that because it was mostly against bots. Let me go ahead and read off some of the donations we got today. Richard Lopez with five dollars, Dub TV with two dollars, Garrett Hoskins with five dollars, Giyuku Noragato with five dollars. Two dollar with one dollar and fifty one cents. Alpha Reaper fifteen with five dollars and fifty six cents. Alan Bergman with two dollars and Josh Hatfield with seven dollars and fifty seven cents. Thank you very much for tuning in to this early morning PUBG stream. But I understand it might be afternoon or evening, depending on where you're watching from, since we are international. Kilian, thank you very much for helping with the moderation. I know you were pretty much the only mod here, and uh, I did see Stephen Jay earlier. So thank you guys for the moderation. I appreciate that. Thank you everyone for watching, commenting, liking, sharing, and supporting the stream with donations. That was awesome. I'll see you guys on the next video or the next live stream, and I hope you all have a wonderful day. And always remember, Taylor Swift for life. See you guys later. Bye. Turn it off.